Hello and welcome to OneCRM. This video provides an overview of the OneCRM user interface. What we're looking at here is the login screen. OneCRM is a web-based customer relationship and business management system. You access OneCRM using a browser, such as Safari, Chrome, Microsoft Edge, or Mozilla Firefox. Whether you're using the OneCRM cloud service or the on-premise software, you access it using a web browser. First, let's log in, and then we'll have a look at the general elements of the user interface, such as themes, the menu system, and the overall screen layout. Here, we can select different login options so that our session can use different themes or languages. Over on the left here, your system administrator can add instructions as to what to do if you have trouble with your password or system access. Once we log in, we see the normal OneCRM screen layout. This particular theme is called Claro, and it lets you choose from a range of color options. At the bottom of the screen, you can change your language or theme anytime you like. Next, look at this control bar at the top of the screen. It offers quick access to your calendar and email. Over here, you can access common administrative functions, such as logging out of the system, viewing your own account details, the company directory, or the software's About page. Towards the middle here is a system-wide search tool capable of searching any text you enter anywhere in the OneCRM system. And over here are displayed details of the OneCRM system version you're using, as well as the name of the company it's licensed to. You can click on this information to see the full license details. The last function of this control bar is to return to the top of any screen if you click on an empty area of the control bar. A very handy feature. Now we're going to look at the main menu bar. This offers links to the major function groups of OneCRM. Today's activities, sales and marketing, order management, project management, customer service, and reports and settings. Notice that each of these function groups offers a number of specific types of business data to work with. We call these modules. So for example, in the sales and marketing group, we see modules for accounts, contracts, campaigns, leads, opportunities, partners, marketing events, forecasts, and documents. Also notice the plus signs on the menu options, which let you quickly add new items of information. Each group also typically includes a dashboard, which shows data from several of the modules in that area in a series of small dashlets. These dashlets are small tables of information or charts of business data, or external data such as weather, news, or stock prices. On each screen within one CRM, there is also a sidebar containing shortcuts and last viewed information. You can click here to either hide or reveal the sidebar. On smaller devices, it's automatically hidden. Shortcuts are quick links to perform common tasks. They vary with the module currently in use. The last viewed list is a handy way to return quickly to items of data you've recently worked with. Finally, you'll see a help icon, which you can click to get access to OneCRM's very comprehensive online guide. It offers a handy search feature, which lets you quickly find the information you're looking for. Now that you've learned a bit about the OneCRM system, if you have your own username and password, now is a good time to log in and explore. To get the most out of your OneCRM system, we encourage you to watch more videos, get your own copy of the user guide, and contact us with any questions you may have. Thanks very much for watching, and we hope you enjoy using OneCRM.